you know, overall, this technology is going to make uh, driving a truck a lot easier, uh, specifically if you're an owner operator and you have a, a kit on your, on your truck that allows it to drive 24 or 7, you're going to have a lot more uh, return on investment for that, so that's really interesting there. And you know, just like Uber's basic business, um, you know, it was interesting because we both added drivers, you know, as um, you know, driver partners uh, on the system as well as new customers. I think the same thing is going to happen in trucking, where we're going to add capacity on the carrier side by bringing new technology that's going to allow the trucks to be more productive. Not that should be like a third of the time, but you know, ideally 24/7. And then at the same time, you brought on extra demand, and so by having uh, a more efficient way of matching uh, um, freight and carriers, we're going to be able to you know, boost the demand for this. So I, th I see the industry growing much more to kind of answer your previous question. So driver shortage is probably going to be still a real thing for the next couple of years, but I imagine long down the road that like none of the new trucks will have a cab on them. It just doesn't make sense many years from now to have that.